Hey y'all, what y'all finna get into today? Um, well, first of all, you late. And as you can see, we are in the middle of an open heart surgery that you are also supposed to be helping us on. That's why his chest is open like No, that. we're just playing around. Girl, I thought it was a dummy. Wait, so we really gonna have to open up the heart, like, literally, like, not figuratively? Yes. Yeah, that's the heart making a little beat. Do -do. Do -do. Do -do. Dr. Washington. <laughs> what on earth are you doing? Girl, give me the tools. I got this. See, I've seen clips of Grey's Anatomy on TikTok next to those slime videos all the time, so I got this. So you don't have any experience? Huh? See, I was a pro when I was playing Papa Surgeria back in the day. Okay, Dr. Washington, can you please cut eight centimeters into the tissue? Yes. Okay, go ahead. Okay, done. See? Eight inches is easy. Wait, what? We said eight centimeters, Dr. Washington. What's the difference? That's the difference. I'll go tell the family. I'm gonna take, I'm gonna take my 15. Yes, and when you come back, you'll be going to jail. Hey, hey ladies! Happy birthday, boo! Who's Thank ready you. for Cancun? Hey. Yeah. 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 Oh, oh are you serious? Did you really just bring your uh name? sis? Why is Terrence here? Yeah. Oh, I forgot to tell y'all. I, I did invite my man on the trip. Y'all cool with that? Uh, I mean, uh, I mean, uh, I guess. Y'all not gonna know that he's there. He's like my emotional support. I mean, all right. Hi, sis. Terrence. Whatever. Nah, y'all turn the music off because y'all being mad loud. Like, what? we're not even being loud. Like, we're you? in Cancun. Like, what are you talking about? Like, y'all so crazy. Like, hey, boo, I just checked all of us in and we're going to take our stuff upstairs. You coming with us? Actually, my man and I are going to stay at another hotel. Why? What's wrong with this hotel? We just want to be a little private. Like, that's all. Well, why not just get another room instead of another hotel? Like, isn't that crazy? Well, no, because my man said that he want to be as far away from y'all as possible. So, what? We'll see y'all at dinner. Nice though. We'll see y'all at dinner. Hey, hey, girl, your hotel is mad nice. Overlooking the water, you got a good room. But anyways, we all getting ready to go out to the beach. Y'all trying to come with us? Of course I'm down. Okay, cool. Baby, you want to go with us? No. Um, okay. Well, my man's not going, so I'm going to just stay back with him. I mean, why can't you just come Bye, out with boo. us? Wait, what are you doing? Baby, can you hold my stuff while I go ziplining? What's wrong? He's not trying to zip line with us? Nah, he said he don't want to go. Nah, because it's mad whack. Like, I don't want to do that. So why did you come if you're not going to do nothing? Right. Like, that makes no sense. Like, why are you getting Why did you come? Y'all so crazy, like. Wait, who got the five surfing turfs? We didn't order this. And oh, yeah, it was me and Terrence. Um, so are y'all not going to pay for it? Because we're not paying for it's that. It's an all-inclusive, though. Oh, all -inclusive, my birthday. That is not are you Y'all so that crazy, one? like. Okay, sis, what is good with you? Because you've been ignoring us the entire trip. Like, you literally turned this into a vacation. Me and my man just wanted to be together and be private. Like, we you're get that, but it's a birthday man. trip. Are you kidding me? It's you didn't even say happy though. birthday. You spent no done. time. What are you we talking about? We were hanging out with us. Y'all in the taxi on the way here. Frank, you but cannot you be serious. But you ignored us the whole trip. Right. Like, like, you didn't like, even want to talk to us at all. You didn't want to go out with us. Exactly. You didn't want to go out with us. I'm not the one that only bought $9 on the trip. Like, it was all in That's the change the fact that you bought your whole Man You're jealous. And nobody You're jealous because you don't even have a man. Oh, so we don't make it like that. That's what you're going to say to me? You're mad. You're weird. You're mad. Your man is not even defending you, though. He's literally sitting there watching you. Who cares? Right. Like, he's not even like, 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 it doesn't involve you doing all this for a while. You're trying to get him involved in a situation. You put yourself in that situation. Yes. So why is that? This is literally why I do not go on vacation with no females. Like, these girls is mad jealous. Babe, remember that time? Nah, shorty, don't put me on camera. I, I wasn't going to put you on camera. I'm just saying, like, isn't it crazy how... If you woke up this morning, say amen. Amen. Mm -hmm. Because some of us did not. No, 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 not. Time no, and a place, no. Terrence. Time and a place. Hey. Terrence, give me the mic. Give me the mic, No, nope, you're done. The floor is yours, Miss Washington. <laughs> mm. Yep, I knew it. It's all Take right, your baby. Time, baby. It's, it's all right. right. It's all right, baby. We know, baby. We you all got it. I'm gonna take her outside. Lift every voice. Stop laughing. Nah, back in the day, y'all daddy was wild, man. I remember we used to no, no, there's no, kids no, here. Man, I'm, I'm gonna tell y'all the repass though. Come on, man. <clears throat> that reminds me, um, let me tell you all this funny story that happened back in 1984. We got to get to the summer. So it was a cold winter. summer night when the air was Janice, crisp, we got to stay and, on um, schedule, baby. Me and Leonard, we used okay, to thank go to you, this Janice. Like, store and Janice. we used to buy Uncle Leonard. Stop it. Been, Give it back. Like, you My Uncle Leonard has Zaire been a great. I didn't even talk to you. Hey, Amaya and Zaire. 
No, but let me say this though. Who is that? None of y'all cared about him when he was alive though. No, oh. I was the one taking care of him in his final days, and y'all didn't want nothing to do with him, right? But y'all didn't Can want nothing to do with him, please? right? Come on, let's go. No, let's go. don't touch me. Miss, I don't want any problems with you. I was just... when everybody else spoke. I get that, but this not I'm the not time in the place. I'm not going anywhere until I finish what I have to say. Now, why is everybody in this room so sad when we have so much to be thankful for? Mm. You woke up with air in your lungs, right? That's mm -hmm. right. And you woke up with food on your table. I sure mm. did, and bless. And you woke up being able to walk, right? Yes, I did. Exactly. Amen. So mm -hmm. life is good and we have to celebrate. Yeah. Yeah. I'm big Dominica. Yeah. You cannot touch me. You cannot touch me because you have the opportunity. Not a Not No. I have a people lie. Do not lie. You know that. Hey, you better break up that fight before you get fired. Come on. You Come on, mommy. Dale. Dale, mommy. Dale. What you looking at? Okay, our next contestant is Alexis. Absolutely. Uh-uh. <clears throat> nope. Nah. Ouch, looks like we got some people that pop their balloons. So Alexis, can you say your age and what you do for a living? Um, yeah, my name is Alexis. I'm 25. <clears throat> That's too way old. too old. Um, and I am an attorney. Oh, no, nope. oh, ma'am. <sighs> Okay, we're going to go on over here and see why some of these fellas pop their balloons. Okay, so what's your name, sir? Uh, my name is Antonio. Um, I run a business. Okay, and why did you pop your balloon, Antonio? Nah, 25 is just really old for me. Like, it's just way too old. Like, Okay, and how old are you, Antonio? Uh, I am 47. What? Okay, we're heading over to the next gentleman. Sir, can you please say your name, what you do for a living, and why you pop your balloon? My name's Antonio. I'm unemployed and I'm 30. And the reason why I pop my balloon is because being a lawyer, that means you're like well established and like you already, you got it together. And I don't like that. All right. Well, let's head on over to the next gentleman who popped his balloon. Go ahead, sir. I'm Tyler. I'm 31. I'm a landscaper. And the reason why I pop my balloon is because um, she's wearing a green shirt and um, I'm not really a fan of green shirts. This is a black sh shirt, though. Oh, yeah. That's what I meant. I'm not really a fan of that color shirt. Okay, moving on to the next gentleman. Can you please say your name and why you pop your balloon, sir? My name is Hakeem. I'm 27 and she's not ugly, but she not cute. No disrespect. Um, she a beautiful girl, but she not really pretty. Like, she all right for real. Okay, well, what about you, Alexis? Do you find this man attractive? Um, no. I'm now you ugly, shorty. You ugly. I meant to say you ugly. That's why you ugly. Okay, next gentleman. I'm Chris, and I pop my balloon because her ears are just too round. Um, I'm just not really a fan of round ears, so yeah. Okay, now we're going to the gentleman that did not pop his balloon. Can you please say your name and why you did not pop your balloon? Yeah, sure. My name is Joaquin, and I feel like she could be submissive and, you know, do what I say, and she just has that factor. Now, Bobs, I want to dedicate this moment to you guys. Woo! Yes! So, yes! who would like the mic? Nikki, me! Nikki! Nikki! Nikki, 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 Nikki! All right. <clears throat> The night is still young. The night is still young. The night is expired. Nikki, I can do way better than him. Please, please. The night is still young. The night is still Wait, Nikki, please. Nikki, over here. Nikki, please. Nikki, Nikki. The night. Oh. Okay. The night. Oh. The night is still No, it ain't. Anybody Nikki, else? please, I'm going to definitely body this. Like, Nikki, come on. They, they just joking around. Come on, I got this. The night is still... Nikki, one more. I'm the biggest bar. Please, please, I'm going to let you down. The night is still young. All right. The yeah. night is still young. The night is still young. What? Oh. No, I'm Nikki, scared. let me try. I didn't finish, Nikki. How'd I do? Okay, but we are all done. You love your hair? I love it. Amazing. So your total is going to be $158. What the? Yo! Are you still I'm, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I was, I was playing. I was playing. What's I, 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 it wasn't me. I didn't. I you didn't done think, lost yeah. your mind. No, I'm, I'm going to pay you right now. I'm going to pay you right now. I promise. Is there anybody in this room who objects? I do! Oh, I'm kidding. God. I'm kidding. I'm so sorry. What? No, no, no. I was just, I was just joking. I'm sorry. I'm... I cannot wait to go to this new restaurant. Yo, now. what if I just... Oh! Uh -huh. What? Michaela, what I'm sorry. I, I didn't mean it. No, I was just, I was just trying to like. No, no. 
Okay, boo, you all set with a full set. Thank you, all sis. Right. You always get me right. Of course. So your toe's gonna be 290. Whoa! What? what? I, I'm playing, I'm playing, I'm playing. I, wasn't, I, wasn't play gonna, I just wanna see how you were gonna react, girl. Like, I, I was, I did not spend I was all this money. If everyone can just pass around the bucket and donate. Yeah, but Pastor Smith, last Sunday you asked us to donate money, and now this Sunday you got on Jordans. Like, that's <gasps> what You better be quiet. I don't care if it's true. And Uber there's gonna cost like 12 Girl, you smell good. Oh, uh, thank you, boo. I bought that little body glaze thingy from like uh, TikTok or whatever. I smell mad edible right now. Like you can literally get, what the ow? Did you just bite? I didn't my mean to eat you, girl. I didn't mean. I did. I did not mean. You. You just I said you was edible. Like, I just wanted to taste. Here's your check, ladies. Now have the day you deserve. Thank, Thank you. you. Imagine if we just left right now and didn't even pay. Why would you even think to do something like that? Like we don't do that. Girl, I would never do that. I know, but that's such a weird thing. What? The? I don't I'm know. Sorry. I'm sorry. I was, I was just playing. Why I was would playing. you even? It could have been a fire drill. You never know. Like you never know. Trey, I had so much fun on our date. I had a great time too, shorty. So we gonna boom shaka locker or not? Hello? Oh, she really not coming back. Listen, I'ma spare you because you don't want this Bucky's tearing face. Girl, why? She will be hearing from my goons in Idaho. Mm-hmm, sure will, friend. Let her come to Boogerville. Right. Because I would have had her spooked. Ooh, she don't want that, friend. She don't want She that. don't want it, friend. She don't want sure it. Sure don't. Nah, she almost tried me. I almost let that Caribou City girl in me come she out. She would have had a bad I day. almost let the Caribou City come out. You would have rocked I was like, world. no, let me keep her inside. Let me keep her inside because she don't want that for real. Now, what you don't want to be a lazy town at night because we give it up. What y'all give up? Like speeding tickets? Ooh, I'm scared. I'm you shaking. should be scared. Chatter City made me, but Rooster Road has definitely raised me. Friend, why you always got a nasty attitude everywhere Um, you go? Because I'm from Dushel Styles and we always disrespectful like, nah, she acting tough now, but a real Potato Heights girl gonna humble her. She's like, oh, you're from that little small town? That's big dinosaur towers to you, sweetie. And she's talking about some, I'm from Platypus Pines. Exactly. Would you be scared of somebody if they said they was from Platypus Pines? <laughs> what is a Platypus Pines? Exactly, Platypus had that. Wait a minute, why are you putting mustard all over your face? Like, what's that about? Oh, girl, we do this all the time in Bizzle Snark. Oh, You're not okay. really gonna get it. It's a Bizzle Snark thing. Hi, excuse me. Um, excuse me. I just really needed help. See that one other employee that's clearly helping six people? But Why don't you ask him for help instead of me that's doing nothing? What? Oh my Whoa. gosh, stop. <laughs> um, Sabrina, Sabrina, weren't you supposed to be getting shoes for a customer two hours ago? What happened? Ooh. Oh, yeah, they didn't have his size. I mean, you could have told him that two hours ago. Oh. Sabrina, you not doing your job. Ooh. Shut up. Those shoes definitely look good on you. I wouldn't have thought about them if you hadn't recommended them. Miss, you were great. supposed to be helping me. No. Are you serious? Hey, yo, y'all got these in a size 14? No, we only got fives left in those. I mean, can I still try the fives? Miss, do you need help with anything? Yes, can I try these Air Forces in a women's seven, please? You definitely not a seven with those dogs. Dogs? Jamal, can you go to the back to see if we got a men's 15? What? Oh my gosh, Trey, Bro. can you please help me grab the eight and a half? I'm so short and I can't reach it. Oh yeah, that's why we have a ladder. It's right next to you. Okay, so the shoes fit okay, right? It's a little uncomfortable. Can I actually try a size? Hey, Sabrina, once you're done, that gentleman over there with the dreads and tattoos needs your help with the Jordans. I'm gonna help him right now! Wait, but you're not done. Hi, excuse me. I was wondering if you could help me. Hello? Miss, I know you're not a mannequin. You just moved. Hello? Excuse me, where's the bathroom? The bathroom? Achoo! Bless, oh, bless you, you. Bless, bless you, bless you, gosh. bless you, girl. Thank you. A spider. Where? Oh, I thought you said free sale. Can I sit here? <laughs> you cannot sit there. You cannot sit there. No, 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 no. What time is it? Um, it's uh six o'clock. Are you happy to be in Paris? Yes, I will have the croissant. I can see your lace. What lace? That lace. The one right there. That lace. Are you always this difficult? Only for you. Hello. Hi, welcome to the Boyfriend Store Customer Services. Can I help you? Yeah, I would like to make a return. Okay, what are you returning? I'm returning my boyfriend. What's wrong with him? Well, I'm bored and I want a new boyfriend for Valentine's Day. I don't think this one's for me. Not for you? Well, he's too nonchalant, he doesn't let me become a passenger princess, and he chews too loud. Ma'am, I'm sorry, you can't return him. All sales are final, even if you're not satisfied. What? But I'm not satisfied. He chews too loud and cries at reality TV shows. I'm not satisfied. I need my emotional time and money back. Ma'am, this isn't like returning your car at CarMax. We can't just give you your money back for it. What? Within 30 days, up to 1,500 miles, even if you're not in love. Fine. I'm going somewhere else. Okay, we'll have a good... Oh, and by the way, you guys can learn a thing or two from CarMax. It's way better. And they wear those fresh polos. <laughs> Up to 1,500 miles within 30 days, huh?
I just don't understand how the girlies that are born in the year 2000 are 24 years old. But I was born in 1865 and I'm also 24 years old. Right. Like, that don't make no sense. Bro, I literally still look like my ultrasound picture. I mean, not really, though, but like... No, for real. Like, I'm really giving zygote. Girl, do I look young? Uh, what do you mean by young, though? Like, unborn child young. Apparently, a newborn baby went missing from the hospital. Like, wah, wah, I'm right here. Girl, Rosa Parks just wrote me a letter asking me what I'm wearing tonight. Girl, I'm not going out to the gathering. I literally look so young. I haven't even washed my face yet, girl. Yeah, I can tell, girl. See, that's why I still look younger than you, because I drink from the fountain of youth. Well, the fountain must be contaminated. I'm literally 22. Okay, so why is there a picture of you in my textbook standing next to MLK marching the summer protest, though? Like, isn't that true? That's literally AI. Like, that's not even me. Like, I would You're never- You're literally wearing the same shirt in the photo, though. Okay, well, I would never- I asked Harriet Tubman what time we were going to get up and leave, and she was like, oh, when I feel like it. Girl, if you don't want me to go with y'all, just say that. Oh my goodness, besties, I have partnered with Norwegian Cruise Line, so get ready with me to go on a cruise that leaves the dock in nine minutes. Since I only have nine minutes to pack my clothes, drive to the pier and check in, the most logical thing for me to do at this very moment is my makeup. Norwegian Cruise Line has launched their Month of Tomorrow's campaign, which is a month long contest where challenges are posted each week for the audience to compete on social media. And at the end of the contest, they will select three winners to win a cruise package. You guys have no idea how excited I am for this cruise, especially since my dad took my yacht away. Like see, I too am relatable. But anyways, I am so stoked because this is basically like a bigger yacht with like 4,000 people. I cannot wait to eat out on the deck, karaoke, unlimited ice cream cones, theme days, and of course, shamelessly hold the buffet line so everybody can watch me take boomerang videos of the food. This cruise is a much needed solo trip. Despite the fact that I'll be bringing my production team, my emotional support pig, my hairstylist, my makeup artist, and my publicist, like that's it. Okay, I'm almost done packing. The cruise is gonna be 72 hours, so I just wanna pack with all my light essentials. And don't worry, this 10 foot ring light is totally gonna fit in my suitcase. Okay, so I think this is everything. If you guys are interested in entering the challenge, check out Norwegian Cruise Line to enter the Influence Us Challenge, which is challenge number five. And from there, you can submit your own travel influencer video. And if you guys are interested in learning more about Norwegian Cruise Line's Month of Tomorrow's campaign, check them out for a chance to win a cruise package. Bye! Hi, welcome to Raising Cane. Whoa, can... whoa, whoa, Khadija. Now, is that how we greet our lovely customers? You seriously about to make me sick? Yes! Say... Or you're fired. Bok, bok, bok. It's chicken o'clock. What can I get you? Chicken, chicken, which combo you picking? Go ahead. <laughs> I'll take the clucking sandwich combo. Welcome to Raising Cane's. If the chicken ain't kicking, then girl, you must be tripping. What can I get you? Let me get a five piece combo. Whoa, whoa, what are you doing? I just asked you. Should've chicken, like, okay, well, you should have said that. Okay, well, you should have said that. You gotta be trying to beat with me. Hi, can I get a box combo with no coleslaw, please? No, because you decided to wear Ugg boots today. Let me get a box me? combo with extra coleslaw. Extra? Welcome to Cane's. If the chicken ain't clucking, then knuck if you bucking. Go ahead. Um, can I get a box combo with no sauce, please? Just the chicken only? Sir, I think you need the sauce. No, I really don't want the sauce. I, I, I'm fine, I'm fine. I don't need you it. You do need the sauce. Why do you, I need the really sauce? You really do need the sauce. You can't eat it without it. Yo, Rasputia, where's my combo at? I've been waiting here mad long. Well, I'm gonna give you that combo, all right? Where? Up oh, there he is. Where is he? Is that him? Yep, right there. What's up, Daddy! little man? How you doing? Hi, Amiri. Hi. You must be the famous Amiri your daddy was telling me about. Happy birthday. Thank you. Hi, you must be Kayla, right? I'm Amiri's mother, Shanice. Yeah, I am. Well, it's so nice to meet you. Devon didn't tell me he was bringing somebody to the party, but that's all right. Thank you for bringing a gift as well. Yeah, well, I'm the stepmother now, so stepmother. it's really important that I need to be at these events because I'm clearly in the picture now, so yeah. I mean, this is me and my son's first time meeting you, so... Yeah, well, honestly, it's about time that we met considering all the things that I've heard about you. Oh, really? What did you hear about me? Come on, baby. She not worth it. This is not the time and the place to do this. Not because I no, don't know. No, because I'm tired of letting her walk all over you. <laughs> You walk need to stand up for yourself. Over. So I'm gonna stand up for my man. Devon, really? You're literally a terrible person, <laughs> and you didn't even let Devon see his son. <laughs> Excuse me? Oh Baby girl, you have no idea what's been going on. So please stop. Devon is a very hardworking and dedicated you man so who is a good father. What? And the fact that you're taking that away from him is I so can't, heartless I and so insensitive. Okay. You're just mad because of the fact that he moved on and what? you didn't. And he's happy where First he is. First of all, Devon is more than welcome to see his son anytime that he wants to. He has not called or asked to come visit so i'm not 
not keeping him away. And respectfully, I think you need to mind your business. It is my business no, because it is I'm not. in the picture now. This is between me and Devon. Well, Devon and I have been dating for three days, oh, and he please. told me that he would never do me like how he, he did said you. That to so everybody. that's why you're mad. Who's that's mad? literally why you're Who's mad. Baby, let's go. No, she's not girl, worth it. Please, you are definitely no, not worth it. Because you don't you understand how baby, horrible don't even you are give her to no Devon, attention. and you're hurting really, your whole like you family. Do? That's let's not a court date. Don't even entertain her. She's not even worth it. That's not right. Hi, Hi, welcome to Costco. Thank you. Have a good one. Hi. Hello. Thank you. you. Go. Good morning, miss. Can I see? Thank you. <clears throat> good morning, miss. How are you? I'm just going straight to the cash. Membership? Yes, but I'm only just going to the food. Membership? Miss, I know that. But Membership? I, I left it in my car. I'm just trying Membership? to. Membership? Miss, I'm only going to get the- Ma'am, if you don't have a membership. I know that, miss, but I'm only here to go straight to the- Give me your membership! Ah! Ah! <laughs> Please! Miss, I'm just going to the cafeteria to get up a slice of pizza. Not me getting jumped again? <coughs> oh, my bad, friend. My bad. You know, you, you should have said that earlier. I was you know, trying to- Go outside. How? My leg is Have broken. a great experience. Hi, welcome to Costco. Look at that girl's hair. Whoa. Hey, boo, I really love your hair. It looks so pretty. That was Thank my line. Thank you. I can't believe that's your real hair. It looks so long and beautiful. That's definitely hair goals, boo. Yeah, girl, your hair's so pretty. Actually, it's not my real hair. No way. It's a wig. <gasps> what? No way. Get out of town. I'm not going anywhere. That's crazy, boo. It really looks like your real hair. It looks so nice. You gotta be playing. It's a wig. I promise you. Look. <gasps> no way. Wow. Whoa. And it's glueless, too? That's crazy. Thank you. Girl, it's your line. Oh, uh, I know girlies don't get heat. Where did you get the wig? Well, I got it from Sugar Booger Hair. They're having a really big sale right now. No way. That is so crazy. Wait, what are my lines again? I have to go now. You should. Are you sure that's not your real hair? I still can't believe it. Wow, that's crazy. No. Hi, my beautiful, delicious baddies. I have been getting so many requests to do a what's in my bag video and we're doing it today. I am so sorry for the goofiness. I am just so excited. Oh my goodness, please do not judge me. These are my literal holy grail items. First thing is obviously going to be my wallet. Let's see how much I have in here. Nothing. Next is my lotion because I always need to stay moisturized. Next is obviously going to be my onion in case I get hungry. Like who doesn't have an onion in their purse? Next up is mustard. I mean, duh, if Beyonce keeps hot sauce in her bag, I'm keeping my mustard in my bag. Next is my water bottle. I have to stay hydrated. Next is obviously my wig. You never know when you're going to have a bad hair day, ladies. Okay, this next one is a little bit heavy. Ugh. Next, I have my vacuum. You never know when you're going to make a mess. I mean, who doesn't have a vacuum in their purse? Next is my 10-foot ring light. I mean, what kind of influencer would I be if I didn't have a 10-foot ring light in my purse? Next is my office chair in case I... Okay, and finally, this is the weirdest thing I have in my purse. Don't judge me, okay? But a hair tie. I know I'm so weird. Like, who carries a hair tie? Like, oh my... Comment down below for what more videos you want to see from me next. Bye. Okay, guys. We are not going to... Oh, I'm nervous, girl. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. Please don't say The it. Bronx? No! Whoa! Man, that was the one I picked. I really wanted to go there. That was a good one. Okay. We are not going to Nebraska. What? Are you kidding me? We missed it out on, on Nebraska? Dang. Come on. Okay, we are not going to. Come on, y'all. Come on. Jamaica. I mean, I'm fine with that. Yeah, yeah that was yeah, easy. I yeah. Yeah. yeah, I don't Yeah, that must have been a throwaway. Jamaica, Queens, y'all. No! Oh! I'm not going anywhere no more. I'm sick of this. Come day. on, y'all. We got bad luck. Okay, we are not going to. I don't want to look. Antarctica. Are you Are you serious, me? That one was though? Mine. Oh. That was a good one. Come on. Okay, y'all. We are not going to Potato Heights. What? Oh, y'all, we missed out on the good places, y'all. I don't want to go nowhere. No, no, I need to step out. I need to step out. Oh, I need to step outside. Out. Okay, we are not going to Iguana Farms. Oh, I'm about Yo, to lose. Is it. Are you kidding me? I really wanted to go there. Whoa. Whoa. No, I'm getting mad now. All right, y'all. This is the last one. We are going to. Oh, this one's mine, y'all. What'd you put? Paris. Paris. What? what? Why would you Paris? That? I'm sorry. I can't really? come up with anything. So I you really? literally picked something better. Oh, like, my God. No, 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 we're, 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 we're not going, going there. We're going to redo it. Everybody got a pen and paper. 
You guys, I have devastating news. What happened? Is everything okay? I'm leaving. <clears throat> you guys, there's bagels in the break room, y'all. Aisha. Oh, gosh. You know you're one of my favorites, right? You literally told on me for coming in late. I would like for you to have this tape since I won't be needing it anymore. What? Mondays, am I right? But this is my last Monday. <laughs> Who's gonna miss me? <clears throat> Lashana, I am going to miss you the most. My name is Lauren and we never work together. Hey Tyler, now that we're no longer coworkers, you should unblock me from social media now. I think I'm good. When's the due date on that? Client wants it by March 9th. <gasps> And then he told me the assignment was due on the 9th, but I was leaving March 8th. <laughs> oh my gosh, you're so lucky. You guys, I'm giving away free pens because I won't be needing them anymore since I'm leaving. Who wants my pens? We should totally hang out and keep in touch. Yeah, we should. I'm definitely down. When do you want to hang out? Sometime this decade. I'm literally so bored. You could help us on a project you'd started. But I'm leaving. So when is the secret party that you guys are having? Oh, it's going to be on March 9th. But I'm leaving on the 8th. Well, yeah, exactly. Melanie, do you like that Applebee's gift card that I got you? Yeah, thank you so much. But I noticed it was used already. They called me and told me over the phone. But... Hello? Okay, put a finger down if you ever took money out of an old lady's purse. Dang. Oh, that was too easy. Girl, girl, you know everybody do that. That's normal. Okay, put a finger down if you've ever been to prison. Really? You trying to get all of us oh, out. What? Who hasn't been right. to prison? Like... Okay, put a finger down if you've ever taken candy from a baby or been involved in a high-speed chase. Are you kidding me? No, we didn't restart this game. Put a finger down if you never put the tray table up when the plane is landing. Oh, that's <gasps> not. Really? No, that's really I not. Do I can't associate myself with people like that. Like like that. Something Are you serious? Messed up. What you mean you don't I'm do that? looking at you differently, girl. Nah, you got bad energy. No, like, I, I don't feel safe right now. Like, you're not the friend that we thought you were. No, for real, Nah, like... switch seats with me because I don't want to sit yeah, next to uh -uh. her. I don't feel I'm safe. I'm not sitting next girl, to her. I really think you should go because we really don't want that energy I'm shaking right now. Like, what? Y'all know this is about to be a serious video when you see the LED lights and no title. So everybody at this point knows what happened with the ban. Unfortunately, instead of worrying about human rights that we all keep asking for, this country is more so worried about a belly dancing app. Imagine having to rock your hips on Instagram. And before y'all be like, oh, they're not gonna ban it, they're not gonna ban it, calm down, you're doing too much. I know I joke about, but we gotta be so for real, like, come on now. So I will be moving a lot of my videos to IG and YouTube shorts up here. So I'm just letting y'all know if you still want to see my videos, just follow me on the gram because I'm going to start transitioning onto there. So if you slowly see that I'm posting a little bit less on TikTok more than usual, then that's why. If you still want to keep up with me, then go to my Instagram. My Instagram is also personal, so you'll be seeing my little selfies or whatever, or just me talking on my story. Like, if you really want to, like, keep up with me, not only will I be posting my skits, you guys are just going to see my regular... I'm not going to lie, I ate that. I really ate that up. I ate that up! Don't play with me! Y'all are like, oh, we still got five months. We still got five months. Oh, why are you worried about that? Okay, and then what's going to happen when it's five months? Y'all are going to be cooked and scrambled. And before y'all be like, oh, they're going to sell it. They're going to sell it. They're going to sell it. Imagine working so hard on something that one person forces you to give everything that you have to them just because. Even for some slim chance that this doesn't get passed, still follow me because, you know, I want to be more active on IG. A lot of y'all going to say, yeah, that's not worth it. So let's be realistic. But yeah, guys, that's all I had to say. So go follow me on the... This is so unserious. But y'all be DMing me and asking me like in some of my videos and like it's literally on my profile y'all like I don't have it there for no reason and let me know like what more th let me know what more things you want to see on there in the comments though <sighs> okay I could do this I could do this uh, bu bu no no um <sighs> okay b back door you should really just say back door you let her off Gotta get off. <laughs> I, I I pulled the yellow the yellow string. Wait no! Wait, Dang! No! I would never show no! that. That's a bad one. Dang! Happy birthday! Happy birthday to you! Oh, happy birthday to you! You right there! Happy birthday, dear to 
Okay, step Ugh. forward a little bit and close your eyes. Shauna, you gotta make this quick. I gotta go to work. Open them. What in the... What? Is this for somebody else or... Uh... Okay, I brought you here. Yeah, why? Because I want to ask you something. You couldn't do this over iMessage? You know, we've been dating for 10 years. Yeah, so why ruin what we got going and, on? And, you know, we've been through a lot. And you're like the man of my dreams. And I know you said that good things come to those that wait. Mm -hmm, yes. And I feel like this is the perfect opportunity. Is this a skit? Um, like. <laughs> um, okay. Love Frederick. We've been together for so long. I mean, yeah, that's what a situation ship is. Yes, you did cheat on me and you had seven kids on me, but I'm willing to raise those kids as my own. You already and do. I'm willing to give you all of my paychecks. You do that too. And I'm willing to be your doormat for the rest of our lives. You already are. But Frederick. Don't do it. Don't, don't will lean you down. Marry Wait, me? please don't tell me. No, no. Oh, gosh. Uh, can I get back to you on that? Because um, I'm just trying to, I'm waiting on to hear back from somebody else. Um, yeah, but if she said no, um, then I'm gonna then I'm gonna say yes. We could take a little rain check on that. Um, you can get up now. You know, if you if you want to let me know, how long is that gonna take? I'm gonna let you know in like five years. I promise, five years is the max. I'm gonna let you know. Um, I'm gonna give you an yes, update by it, then. It's worth the wait. It, it's you worth so the understanding wait. for that. Mm -hmm. Thank you, babe. Yes. I love you, babe. That's why yes. I love you. That's um, why I love you, babe. So I'm seeing that trend on TikTok where people are talking about some, oh, I'm convinced nobody has ever seen this show. But y'all be naming the most basic shows that everybody has seen. Y'all be like, oh, I bet you guys haven't seen Totally Spies. <laughs> Get out of here. I haven't seen one person talk about this show. This show used to give me nightmares. Y'all not touching Ubi. Y'all kidding me. Like, I remember my, I was so scared. I was not allowed to watch this. My grandma thought it was weird. <laughs> and she would not let me watch it. <laughs> Y'all not touching Ubi, like. All I'm right, who can tell me what five minus That's two me. is? Ooh, ooh, I know. Michaela. Three. Wrong. What? Oh, I know, <laughs> I, know. I, know. I, know. I got it, I got answer. it. Okay, so five minus two is if you take the square root of cheese and pretzels and put five physical apples on the table and then place them in a position right next to each other and physically remove two apples and discard two of them in the trash can. Then you hand deliver the apples to Jamaica Queens and then they put them in the garbage chute, leaving those two apples into a disintegration of nothingness. Then if you take the square root of Nicki Minaj and multiply it by ice spice, you get gra three times and leaving that as a remainder. Once you confirm those two apples have disappeared, then that means you have three physical apples that are left on the table. So the answer is three. Correct. That's what I'm looking what? for. What? That's what I just said. I said five minus two is three. That literally makes no sense. You didn't sense show your work. That's what? why it's wrong. You, you didn't show your that work. No I love you. Yeah, me too. Imagine if I cheated right now and messed everything up. Did you check the weather today? I don't know. Yeah, it's cloudy with a chance of cheating. I'm, I'm, um, oh, I feel a sneeze coming in. I cheat on my chest. Oh no, are you having a heart attack? No, I'm just feeling the urge to cheat. Listen, I'm not going to make promises, but there's a huge chance that I might cheat. Okay, what are the chances that you think that might happen, though? About, like, 99%. Okay. Babe, why are you staring at me like that? You're so beautiful. I really hope I don't cheat on you, for real. Clay, fight it! Ugh, fight the urge I'm cheat. trying! Fight Ugh. it! I'm not trying to, like, start nothing, but, like, what would you do if I cheated? Listen, I just want to warn you that I might cheat on you because my dad cheated, so, you know, it might be it might be a little rough. Could you let me know in advance, like, when you might cheat? Um, well... The feeling kind of like comes and goes. Right. Sometimes on Saturdays I get the urge to cheat because mm -hmm. like that's like my biggest day. Right. Um, Wednesdays is a little iffy. Okay, um, I'll write down Wednesday. But you know, today's Sunday, so we should be good. Okay, so like let's pretend that I cheated, right? Um, would you still be like my lifelong fiance? Okay, right now it's just me and you. But if I add a third party, baby, okay. make sure you're wearing your shin guards okay, this time. I will. All right, oh, love you. Good my luck. Gosh, I know that ain't who I think it is. Oh. Brenda? Hi, Sharon! Hi! Mwah. Mwah. I can't believe this. I was like, is that Brenda who used to eat her lunch in the school bathroom? And I was like, is that Sharon? In the flesh. AKA Mrs. I like to hang out with guys because it's less drama. Oh. How are you? I'm doing great. I saw that your car got repossessed last April. That's a big yikes. And I saw that you're on your third divorce on Facebook. Well. Collecting those infinity stones, I see. Still have terrible credit and facing eviction, I see. But anyways, how are the boys? Very good. My oldest is going to college, so. That ran down community college right up the street? No, Harvard. Oh, wow, Harvard. I guess they're letting anybody in. Clearly, they're not letting everybody in there because your son has taken a gap year for 47 years now and he's still not in school. Oh, uh, you gag me there. <laughs> Well, anyways, enjoy the game, Brenda. You too, Sharon. Bye. Desperate. Non-existent neck.
Girl, why did you ghost that man? I thought it was good. Because he started crying in the middle of the movie. Like, who does that? See, Ara, you acting like people don't cry during sad movies all the time. Like... During Mean Girls, the musical? Nah, that's childish to me. Because as a man, why are you eating cashews? Right. Tell me how I went to go use his bathroom and the fan came on with the light. Like, I hate Right? That. Like, that's too much for me. Like, that's too... Girl, why would you block him, though? Because he got a Roku TV. I can't date no man that's broke. Anaya, you acting like you don't got a fire stick yourself. Like, <laughs> I get it. Though, exactly. But... Like, when I saw them purple buildings, I was enraged girl right asia you can't expect a man to know everything girl i asked that man what the three branches of government were he said alvin simon and theodore what the chipmunks how you work on wall street but got brown cabinets like somebody lying ew wait so like what's your nationality i'm jamaican haitian dominican nigerian right, what what I do? I do? hi can i please get a name yes my name hi, is i'm here for doordash hello for doordash Olivia J. DoorDash. I'm sorry, miss. Can you DoorDash. please repeat that? What were you trying to say? My DoorDash. name is DoorDash. Sir. DoorDash. Sir, excuse me. DoorDash. Excuse me. I got Olivia J. Where her food at? Like, can y'all get her food? Sir, listen. Where her food at? We just got the order two minutes ago, so you're going to have to sit over there and wait. <laughs> Okay, Miss, what's your order? Um, okay, so can I have a 10? Oh, yeah, I'm at the restaurant doing a DoorDash order. What does it look like I'm doing? Why do you think I'm cheating all the time? I'm not cheating. You the one that put me on child support. These diapers ain't gonna buy itself, shorty, like. Shut up, shut up, shut Hello, up. Hello, sir. Shut up. Like, Hello. you talking too much. Shut up. Can you please keep it down, oh, sir? Oh, my gosh. Okay, so can I get mango habanero? Nobody with... knows me like you Sir, do. I just want to be nice. Please keep it down. Please keep it down because I'm trying to uh, do my, my job. My bad, my bad. I'm going to keep it down. I promise. DoorDash, your food is ready. Yeah, I don't plan anything. Okay, Zaire, how do you spell BMW? Um, B-E-Y... How do we solve for X? Chosen. You're going to take the square root of Kirat minus Riz, and then you're going to multiply by... Miss Taylor, I need help. Sure, what question are you... <sighs> I know you did not just blow blue raspberry shoelace in my face. Hand no, it over. Put it away. No, put it away. Amiri, can you read the sentence on the board, please? The, 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 the dog, uh, I don't even know what that means for real. Like, what does that even say? Amiri, you're a 22-year-old senior. Something has to give. Okay, Bella, can you tell us what your project is about? My presentation is on the history of the modern-day Civil War. Amazing choice. <clears throat> for seven years, the Barbs and Barty gang have... Sit down. One, Stop. two, three. Stop. I'm talking about okay. not even true. Yes, it is. Okay. 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 If you see me and you trying to see what's up. See? see? Okay, Jeremiah, this might be a trick question. What is the shape of that circle? Uh, it's a rectangle. Jeremiah, I just gave you the... Girl, I was deleting my drafts on TikTok, and then I forgot to tell y'all that I ended up going to TikTok headquarters literally two months ago. Why did I forget to tell y'all that? Ah! I done sold all my other socials, but I didn't even tell TikTok. Like, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. This was like two months ago, right? Because clearly I had a wig and I had like my brows or whatever, but TikTok invited me to their New York office. I'm so mad I didn't tell y'all. Like, what the? But this was for like a one minute creator event where they kind of come up with new features and introduce it to us. I'm sure they're out right now. I was so nervous. I'm not even gonna sit here and lie to you because I'm just not that type of social in real life. But when I tell you that everybody was so nice, I got to meet so many different people. I got to make a lot of new connections. We ended up learning some tips and tricks from TikTok. So that was really nice. And we got to speak to some um, really big creators who came to like give us advice and stuff like that. And, you know, their journey on TikTok. And then after that, we went to like a little happy hour and I got to socialize with a lot of different people. I was so nervous. Like I have really bad social anxiety, so that's why I don't really like to go to a lot of events. Fun fact. But talking to a lot of creators just really made me feel super comfortable. Oh, they have this little ice cream station where you could catch the ice cream. Oh, yeah. What is what is that? I don't know how much I filmed. Oh, wait. This is when me and my homegirl ended up getting nachos right after because we was mad hungry. So, yeah, the nachos was good. Also, do not bring guacamole to go. It's going to be nasty. Dang, that's it. But thank you guys so much for even allowing me to get to TikTok HQ. Like, I wouldn't have done it without y'all. Like, what? Where have you been? <laughs> really? Really? That's how it is? That's really how it is? You really finna ghost me like that, right? So you just gonna leave me out to dry? Don't make me angry. Don't make me angry like you already did. That's why you be struggling every lesson. Every time I ask you to spell Manzana, you can't even do something as simple as that. Where you been at, huh? Huh? You know what's crazy? I think it's real funny that you could commit to a guy that be cheating on you, but you can't commit to us. What did I do to you? What did I do to you? Huh? Huh? 
actually, you know what? It's 2024, new year, new me. You know, I'm, I apologize for getting mad at you earlier, boo. I just haven't heard from you. It's 24 hours. Is everything okay? Are you okay? We miss you. We love you. Por favor. Nah, I'm lying. You better come down your ass by yo or else. I'm not playing with you because it's finna be a real problema real quick. I better see you in 2024 or you finna be as tostada, tostada, as stupida. I don't care. Hi, girls. Welcome to Sephora. Can Lady, I get... you got drunk elephant or not? Oh, it, it's over there. Oh my gosh, Izzy, I see it. <laughs> Hi, my friend and I are looking for the rare beauty blushes. Oh, the rare beauty blushes are going to be You're a there. liar. I checked already and it wasn't even there. You're not even doing your job properly, lady. Is there like a specific shade that you're looking for? Show her the picture. Show the lady the Let picture. Let me find it. No, let's go over there and show her. Over here. My friend's going to take you and show you. Come on. <laughs> Okay, so we ran out of the shade in Courage, but we do have Lucky, which works just as good. That's what I asked for! I literally wanted it in a specific shade. I wanted in Courage, and you bring me the wrong shade that I did not ask for. My dad, who is the president of Timu, will not be happy about this, and you'll be out of a job. Excuse me, do you guys sell the ordinary here? No, honey, but I can suggest Wishful Skin. Ah, you're so useless! Excuse me, which retinol product do you recommend? Aren't you like nine? FYI, I'm actually turning 10 tomorrow. So basically, where's your mother? Okay, sweetie, your total is going to be $10,364.62. Is your mom or dad going to pay? Oh, no, I just took it out of my life savings. So technically, it's my money that I'm going to be Sweetie, using. I don't think Are that's you dumb. Good... I said it was my money, you potato with lashes. What? Sierra, I'm having an amazing time with you, man. Raekwon, I really like you too. But there's something I got to tell you. What? About what I do for work. Baby, it's 2023. Who even job shames anymore? I'm not going to judge you. What's your job? Okay. I work as a lawyer. What? You work a nine to five job? Are you serious? Nah, nah, shorty. I can't respect that. How could you lie to but me? Rick Juan! I can't respect people with those types of careers, man. Nah, bro. Like, that's crazy to me. Rick Juan, I wanted to tell you. Nah, shorty. You could have been an influencer, an entrepreneur, a lash tech, a rapper, a nail tech, a clout chaser, a Tubi movie actress, but you chose to work a nine to five with benefits and PTO? Nah, shorty, I can't respect that. We done for real. But Raekwon, this doesn't define me as a person. How am I supposed to tell my mama this? Nah, this ain't gonna work, shorty. I need to date a respectable woman, like a TikToker. You out here working for other people? Nah, shorty, we done, bro. What? But, but Marie it's Marie over, shorty. I'm out. Go. No. Now, La Joshua, would you like to read your vows to your wife? Oh, I ain't write nothing. My bad. You know what? You know what? I'm gonna just, I'm gonna just speak it from the heart. All right, here it goes. Man, Shauna, we finally made it. We finally Ooh. doing this for real, man. Mm -hmm. Wow. Mm. First off, let me start by saying this, Shauna. I know what you thinking, man. It's about dang time. Yes, finally, y'all. Yes, 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 I know, y'all. I know. I should have been did this. You yeah. think? 21 years of a situationship and nine years of being engaged? Man, we really doing it, man. Right. I mean, I'm going to be honest with you. I'd rather be standing up here with another woman, but I settled for you, and I'm grateful for that. But in all seriousness, Shauna, I just love how committed you are to not loving yourself mm. and how you constantly have low self-esteem. I promise to always disrespect you. Yes. Mm. Make you my doormat. And cheat on you with another woman to make you raise her child. Because I know... You will never leave. Never. Mm -hmm. never no. Ever leave. And the fact that none of your family members are here today just shows that you are committed down woman. Mm. The fact that you're just so easy to manipulate and I'm getting emotional, man. La Joshua, take your time, baby. Take your Whoa. time. The fact that you agreed to not get a prenup even though you make 100K a year and I don't have a job, you are selfless. <sighs> all right, that's, all, that's enough because... Um... That's all, really all I got to say. I now pronounce y'all husband and doormat. You may kiss your bride. Woo! All right, yo! Yo, I always get mistaken for being a newborn baby all the time. They really think I'm a baby. Like, people be telling me all the time that I look 19. Yeah, in dog years. See, I'm 48 and I literally look 18. But wasn't Booker T. Washington your prom date, though? How old do you think I look? I mean, you look at least 52. You meant to switch it around, right? 25, mm -mm. right? Not yeah. Nope. Yo, y'all want to see my high school yearbook? Didn't you graduate the same year as Betty White, though? Like, I could have sworn No, that. she was a grade above me. I'm way younger than her. 
I'm telling y'all, 95 is the new 25. Excuse me, ladies, are you guys in line for the bathroom? We're or? not sisters. We are not sisters. I'm literally her mom. I know we look like sisters. I don't know. Y'all don't know nothing about Teach Me How to Duck. Huh? No one to listen to that senior citizen music. What? Like The sky is blue. What? Oh You're a liar. Where are you always lying, lying bro? Like, she always lying. lying. Smiley, like, come lying. on now. Every you know the sky has no color. Lying. Like, like you the sky is clearly truth. green. Like, like what are you talking truth, about? Like, you're a liar. Like you. The why sky is always, not blue. You the always sky gotta is lie. Like, you right never now. tell the truth. Like, smile. Hi, my beautiful angel. I'm so glad the universe brought us together. And thank you for booking with me again. Now, let's see what the universe got in store for you today, baby. Okay, let me just shuffle my cards and pull up your questions. <clears throat> okay, so your first question is, even though you said no 26 times, is Levante still coming back? No! No, he's not! I'm sick of you asking me this question every single time that you come here. He's not coming back. Get over it. Love yourself. You telling me you could have been sitting with a Prince Charming, but you sitting here crying over a bum that don't wash his sheets, let alone his vines. Oh, look. Look at the time right now. It's 1.11 p.m. on the dot. That means your intuition is telling you that he is a bum and you need to leave him. I don't know how many times I got to tell you that your Delulu will never become true Lulu. That man cheated on you, wiped out your bank account, and turned you against your family. And you still want him back? Spirit, you better calm me down. You better calm me down. You better get me back on my level, Spirit. What you need to be doing is manifesting a job because you clearly making me rich. You really keeping me in business, baby girl. Because you blocking your blessings over a man that be calling himself booger. You need to learn to find that true love within yourself before you come looking for a man. Oh, okay. Sorry about that. Next question. Is Levante my soulmate? No! No, he is okay. not my soulmate! Dang! How was your weekend? Yeah. Reports by end of day. Morning, guys. <gasps> oh my God, Deja. Who's oh that? Oh my gosh, you look great. La, la, no, la, la, wow. La, 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 I la, la, think la. she comes in with a new hairstyle. I thought she was sick insane. yesterday. Is that why she clocked out? Must have been some sick day. Didn't she have a bob yesterday? How I saw her with a 613 bust down at lunchtime. I need whatever she's having in her hair. This is her third it's style real, this right? week. Or is it like, is it like plastic or is it real? Like, I don't think it's real. You never look better. I'm obsessing. Never look better. We are so obsessed. Is she Harry well. Potter? Because I think she a witch girl. That's some sorcery Macaroni, right there. Macaroni, cheese, and rice. Oh my goodness. Khadija. You look Khadija, amazing. Khadija, that's crazy. You look like a new person. <gasps> I almost did not Khadija recognize Khadija from accounting? That's insane. No way. Khadija, I'm dying to know. How long did that take? Six hours. Yo, no No way. In the chair for that long. Wow. I'm telling you, I wouldn't I be able to do it. I wouldn't be able to do it. I really don't know. I couldn't do this it. This looks amazing on Khadija, you. I love this color. give us a 360 color. a little bit. Whoa. 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 No way. Oh, oh my God. God. That was amazing. Don't whack us oh now, Khadija. Goodness. Don't do that. That Khadijah, I am that so obsessed with you. Wait, so does she grow her hair overnight? That's what I was saying. Me and color. Benny from Finance were saying the same thing. Like, she looks so good. Wow, we just love wow. your hair, girl. You went we from Fantasia to Erica Badu in less than 24 hours. I said the same thing. Yes. Hi, Amanda. I just got your IM. You said you needed to talk to me? Hi, Fatima. Yes. <sighs> um, Come in, honey. You okay. Just close the door. You're not in trouble at all. Okay. Also, I don't want to be like rude or anything, but my name is Fatima, not Fatima. You keep saying Okay, it see, wrong. that's what I wanted to talk to you about. It's that aggressive tone, you aggressive. know? Aggressive. You know, Fatima, some of your coworkers are a little bit concerned about your hostility. They feel that your personality is very aggressive and unsafe. And, unsafe? You know, we don't really want that, right? But I mind my business and I do my work and I even work overtime a lot. Like, how is Honey, that? Honey, I have gotten cornrows on my vacation in Jamaica before. So I see you. And I hear you. What? You know, your quiet personality has caused a lot of havoc. And they don't think it's healthy in this situation. I'm sorry. I don't really understand how that's considered havoc. You know, I don't really know if they do that in your hood. What? But at Parker Solutions, we don't really do that here. Okay, I literally yeah. cannot believe you just whoa, said that to whoa. me. Calm down, sister. Don't pop off. Honey, I just want to see where your head's at. I'm just here to get down to the nitty gritty, the pit, the core, the bottom, the glute, the donkey of things. I just want to know if you are okay. I'm fine. To make this environment completely safe because we are all a family here and we are so worried about you. Is this about Rachel from Billing? All I said is that I don't want to be called Fat sis. Like, Fatima. I give up.
We at Parker Solutions want to ensure that you are comfortable. And Rachel has informed me that she meant no harm. She even looked it up on Urban Dictionary and she said it was a term of endearment. But that's not whoa, really- Whoa, whoa, whoa. See how you're raising your arms like that? That is the aggression that we're talking about. Are you serious? All I am saying is that you should engage more. You don't go to happy hours. You don't talk. You just do your work and go home. You know, you don't like to try the food at our potluck. You know, Brian from accounting even saw that you spit out his casserole and he was- we all spit it out by that. like we just want you to be a team player i didn't think that was part of my job description that you i had know, i feel like you and shaniqua from accounting would be great friends and you should definitely talk to her more i thought you guys were sisters obviously. her name is actually sarah and we're not sisters so you're not no and before you go one more thing Fatima. Fatima, I was going to say that. I was going to say that. You definitely were you not, are but. on your team. We love you. What? Hey. So I've been thinking about this a lot. And sometimes being an influencer is kind of hard. So I was thinking about maybe hiring an assistant. So yes, the rumors that all two of you have been spreading were true. I'm hiring an assistant. I do not have the application in front of me, but these are a few of the things that I look for in an assistant. So number one, the salary is going to be about $400 a year. I feel like that's kind of fair. $400 is like way too generous. So maybe like $350, but yeah, I feel like that's fair. And yes, I will be also taking out taxes. What I'm also looking for is that I want you to be available at least 23 hours a day and you do get a nine minute lunch break. So that's like a total plus. Also, because I'm an influencer, I expect you to take every single picture of me. I am also looking for a therapist. So you must allow me to trauma dump on you. Also, you must be responsible for my Instagram captions. Pink Friday 2 just came out. There are no excuses for no captions. And you also have to be commenting and liking every single post that I make. If you don't, you will be fired. Also, if we're out in public together, do not post a location. Also, when we go out, there's like a hierarchy thing. If we are at a restaurant and ordering food and your food just happens to come before mine, you must wait for me. And when my food comes, you must wait until my camera eats first. Then I eat. Then you can eat. To be honest, it's just really insensitive, tone deaf, and unsafe at the fact that I'm recording a video and your half-bitten sandwich is on the table. Like, ew. Also, another simple task is I want you to check all of my emails, even on holidays. I, like, like, that's, like, everything I'm saying is so, like, bare minimum. Also, once in a blue moon, as a perk, you do get PR packages because I receive so many, but you'll only get them if I do not like them. And that's kind of rare because I usually like my PR packages, so you kind of won't really get anything. Sometimes the packaging, the boxes are really cute. Like, you might keep the box. Also, this job does not have any paid time off, so any days that you miss, like let's say if you want to go on vacation, your salary will be deducted. Also, if I were to ever be canceled, you will be taking full responsibility on my behalf. And if you don't, I will still say it was you. Okay, I think that's everything. Let me know if you want to apply. Applications open on Christmas Day. Bye! Hey, Janae. Hey. I noticed that your team's notification was yellow for five minutes. What were you doing, like, during those five minutes? Well, I had to get up and use the bathroom. Okay. Am I not allowed to okay, go? Okay, well, if you're going to go to the bathroom, you got to let me know. I know I'm not your boss, but I am on a higher level than you, so not I can really. tell you what to do. I'm not saying that I don't trust you, but I'd rather be CC'd on every single email that you send. Why? Okay, so I noticed that you sent this email, but, like, I didn't get a chance to check it first. So, oh. you know, moving forward. So I noticed that you put this in your email, but, like, Honestly, that's not how I would have done it. Okay. I mean, I have been here longer than you. See, if that was me, I would have done that in like five minutes. I'm just saying that like this is like the right way to do it, even though you don't have to follow it, but it is the right way. I just want to remind you that I've been here longer than you, so I know a lot more things than you do. Wait, where are you going? I'm going on lunch since it's 12 o'clock and that's when we all take lunch. I get that everybody goes to lunch at 12, but you should still let me know because oh. if I don't know where you are, it's going to be like a real big disaster. So like moving forward. So two plus two equals four. I'm sorry. She's a little new here. So please disregard everything that she just said. And I'm going to tell you the exact same thing that she said, but it sounds a lot better coming out of my mouth. So two plus two is four. What? Who entered this in? Um, I'm not going to say names, but I did show Janae already how to do it. And I had her do it by herself. You told me to. Okay, Janae, we're going to have a little chat in like my little office. Okay. Um, I feel like you should have informed me when you were going to the bathroom because that's just not really team player vibes. Hey, so next week I'm going to need you to work oh, on. I'm going to be out of office all next week though. Chris actually uh, approved my PTO, so I'm going to be all out next week. Was I 
informed about that? No, because I went directly to our boss. And he- okay, I know he's our boss, but I'm kind of second in command, so I should know about every single thing. That- hey, the billing department just let us know about the whole situation, but I took care of everything, though. Okay, I kind of want to piggyback off of your email because I don't really like what you just said and I don't trust you. No, so- but everything was canceled. Hey, Frank, like- jumping in here. Okay, yes, happy career stop. day. I see each and every one of you are dressed up. I'm going to go around the room and ask to see what you guys want to be when you grow up, okay? Shh, be quiet. All right, Jason, what do you want to be? I'm dressed up as a SoundCloud rapper. Are you serious? Yeah, you said career. Oh, okay. Uh, Dior, what, what are you dressed up as? I'm dressed up as Jada Waiter. I'm also a rapper's baby mama. Are you Ari? Yes. Chance, I know both your parents are lawyers. What do you want to be? I want to have a podcast where I spread my ridiculous views and talk about females all day. Um, okay, Paris Rain. I'm going to be a lash head because, like, to be honest with you, your eyelashes kind of look bad. Sincere. Either a dentist or a scammer. I'm not really sure yet. Kaden. I want to be like Tristan Thompson when I grow up. Amiri? My daddy unemployed, so I want to be like him. But if I do get a job, I'm going to rock my hips on TikTok. Bella, Bella Dream? I want to be like Natalie Nunn and be on Baddies East. Girl, I also put that. I put that I want to be Krishan. Jesse, my smartest student in the class. What do you want to be when you grow up? I want to be a famous actress. Okay, that's reasonable. On Tubi. Okay, I quit. Okay, so unfortunately, I have another list of things that I learned from being on social media in 2023, except this is within the past seven days. Okay, you are not allowed to have vacation highlights in your Instagram bio. You are not allowed to eat alone in public. You are not allowed to have LED lights in your room. You are not allowed to cry at your own wedding, especially if you are a man. You are not allowed to eat free bread at a restaurant because that is big back behavior. You are not allowed to wear an Apple Watch at a formal event. You must apply for Social Security after turning 30. Men who eat oatmeal for breakfast or drink smoothies are considered sassy. You are not allowed to have your phone on Do Not Disturb or that means that you are a narcissist who is terrible at maintaining relationships, lack communication skills, and of course, have avoided attachment style. You are not allowed to wear macage jackets because they are childish. You are not allowed to wear a bonnet in public or on social media. You are not allowed to do your own hair because that is broke behavior. You are not allowed to say that you do not want kids because that is selfish. As a man, you are not allowed to have a skincare routine or take care of your fingernails because that is sassy. Black or brown lip liner is ghetto. You are not allowed to fly Spirit Airlines even if you were just simply trying to save money. You are not allowed to eat at Chili's. You are not allowed to shop at Ross. You are not allowed to have almond-shaped nails. You are not allowed to be too loud or excited or you will be broken up with. You are not allowed to be in the gym for New Year's Day because you are taking up space. Please don't bring this into 2024. Hi, dear. You are such a queen and you are so beautiful. Your TikTok videos are life-changing and inspirational. I hope you are at peace. Anyways, enough of all that. We got a 613 bust-down, glueless, wear-and-go wig that we need you to promote. You are required to record a total of 72 videos for the total price of $10. It will not come pre-plucked, not pre-bleached, and you're going to have to cut the lace, so good luck. Matter of fact, I changed my mind. We only finna pay you $5, but at least you're getting a glueless wig. But anyways, love, these wigs are high quality and so pretty and beautiful, just like you, queen. So please, let us know, dear, and have a very blessed day. I'm looking forward to your email. Hey, besties! I finally moved into my new house, and I'm giving you guys a house tour! <laughs> this is the front of my house facing Applebush Avenue. It's so big and gigantic, you can literally find all the details on Zillow. Come inside with me while I give you every single detail about the floor planning. Welcome to the inside of my house. Oh, and don't worry about locking the door. There's something wrong with it. I always have to fidget back and forth with it, so I just keep it unlocked. This is my main living room. I just love the wide open space. It just lets all the people, the light in. It lets all the light in. Now we're in my closet where I keep all of my prized possessions that are worth $10 million. And in my closet, right behind my pink shoes, is my secret box. 
What's my passcode again? Oh, my birthday. Oh, four, oh, no. This is my bedroom. It has the most perfect view of Apple Avenue. It's so nice. And this is the side of my house where you can also see on Zillow. And last but not least, here is my lovely garage. Well, I gotta kick you guys out now because this is the end of the house tour and I gotta go to the gym. I just love going to the gym at 10 a.m. every day at 10 a.m. Bye guys! I love your ring. Thank you, he got it from Pandora. Wow, that is so Excuse good. me, can I get everybody's attention please real quick? <clears throat> Thank you, y'all, for coming to our engagement party. I just want to give a special toast to my soon-to-be wife, the future Mrs. Robinson. All right, come on, on Shauna. All right, all right, all right. But Shauna, you've been here for me for a very long time. You stayed in a 21-year situationship with me while I was working on myself, and now I'm finally ready to settle down. That's Even though the woman you. I actually wanted to marry already said no, you stepped it up. You stepped it up. You and have then, allowed me to cheat on you multiple times, and you still took me back, and that's how I know you are a good woman. Mm -hmm. and when I cheat, I always feel so disgusted. But to make myself feel better, I always be thinking about you every time I cheat. You make the best meals. I look forward to coming home every night after a long day of cheating because I know where my home is. Mm -hmm. Yes. Mm -hmm. Thank you for accepting my proposal. And even though I was using you as a placeholder to get the girl that I actually wanted, but that girl ended up getting married to another man. So I realized that she was the one this whole time. I was blind. I didn't see it. And even though I cheated on you with all of your homegirls, that just shows that they were fake friends. And the only real friend you got is me. Come on now! And even though I turned you against your whole family and made you choose me over them, that just shows that you're loyal. Mm. Trustworthy. Mm. Mm and you are good enough to be my wife. Yes! Come on. You have really showed me what loyalty is. And you is a down chick. Yes, you really a down chick. And that's why I love you, Shauna. I still might cheat in this marriage, but at the end of the day, I'm going to always come home. That's what it's about. Mm -hmm. Girl, you snagged a good one. I can't wait for it to be my turn to be picked. So I already took up most of y'all time. But with that being said, cheers, everybody, to Shauna. Yes, Shauna! <sighs> You guys, get ready with me to go to the airport and my flight leaves in four minutes. You guys, I'm utterly so stressed out right now. I just came back from a brand trip with Zebra Beauty and now I have another brand trip in Tulum with Dorito Cosmetics. Like I am so drained right now. I literally filmed two YouTube videos today and fed my child. Like today was a lot guys. Like I am so drained. My anxiety is through the roof. Speaking of my child, hi baby. Oh yeah, I didn't tell you guys, I got a pet pig. I'm not sure what I'm gonna name her yet. My mom wanted me to name her Oink, but I'm thinking about Bacon or Porky. Like, is that tone deaf? <coughs> this Charlotte Tilbury is eating me up, I fear. Okay, so this is clearly the finished look. I just wanted to go for like a no makeup, makeup kind of look. Okay, so let me just see how I'm doing on time. Okay, so I have 60 seconds to go to JFK, go through TSA, and make it to my gate. Okay. Let me just put on an outfit. Okay, so this is the finished look. You know, it's giving like absolute cheetah girl. I just wanted to keep like a low profile because like, you know, I don't want people recognizing me and like, you know, I'm famous, duh. So, oh, outfit details. Okay, um, top, lavash. Um, skirt is babouche, obvi. Shoes are Jay-Z and shades are Chips Ahoy. Mm -hmm. Love y'all, bye. Hi guys, welcome to Apple Big <laughs> Hi guys, welcome to Applebee's. How many? Hi, just two adults and one child. Oh, um, is the child in the room with us right now? Uh, yes, my son is 12. Hey, your baby. See? Right this way. Hi, you called me again? Yes, can we get another round of dollarinas, please? Are you sure you need another one? Because why he look like that? Nah, he good. <laughs> Coming right up. Hi, how are you? Hi, welcome to Applebee's, guys. Can we please get a table for four? Ooh, let's see. Um, I'm sorry, but the soccer team, the high school drama club, the knitting association, the Bible study group, and the divorce moms club took all the seating. Oh. So it's gonna be a six hour wait. What? Six hours? Yeah, I'm sorry. Okay, well, what about the bar seating though? Is that not- Ooh, sorry, the bingo club and the chess <sighs> club already took those seats. Are you kidding sorry, me? Man. Like, 
Hi, I'm Jess. I'll be your server for this evening. What can I get you guys? Hi, I will take the filet mignon with a side of mashed potatoes. And Shorty, you most certainly cannot. You will be ordering only off of the kitty meal. Jacque, you always... So she will have the chicken tenders and... Ah, oh, the bum special. Bum! Girl, are you in a situation ship or in jail? Both. Hey! 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 Ooh. Alexis. I'm sorry, miss. I'm sorry. Yeah, Hi, exactly. ladies. Here's your check. Since you guys are a big party, I'm going to have to put everything on one tab. Ooh. So I'm just going to put this right here. Okay, and so then... who's paying? $600? Oh, she gosh. got the check to you, girl. I only had a water. Who ordered onion rings? Oh, oh, my, God. oh my gosh. Did you see what Nicki Minaj posted on her story? No, what happened? What she posted? She posted that she had a sandwich today. No way. She fed herself? Wow. It's crazy. She never eats sandwiches. Wow. If his favorite cereal is pico de gallo, then that means he has an anxious attachment. Style. Wow. Nah, I heard that stubbing your toe is a sign of a trauma response. Girl, what's your zodiac sign? Girl, green eggs and ham. Did you see that mukbang video that Jessica oh uploaded gosh. on YouTube instead of addressing the situation between her best friend and her makeup stylist? No. Like, that's so tone deaf. Nobody cares about these crab legs. Bro, I am so tired right now. Bestie, you are so real for that. What? I appreciate you being real and honest and genuine with me. Girl, I am so hungry right now. Are you hungry? Girl, no. My stomach is closed. What? Did you say that Beyonce coughed around fans knowing that we're in the middle of a panini? That's so tone deaf. She needs to apologize. Girl, I just ordered a Nigerian cheese grater off the TikTok shop. What do you need a Nigerian cheese grater for? And what is that? Like To make Nigerian mac and cheese. Duh. What the? No! Let it out, girl. I know your grandma's looking down on you smiling. No, not the funeral. Tiana and Amon broke up. Huh? I don't believe in love anymore. My sister, you are actually dumb. No! Girl, what? What? Sean just announced that she's taking a break from social media. That's amazing. Maybe you need to get off too. Okay, so this is everything that I have learned from being on social media in 2023. <clears throat> you are not allowed to have brown cabinets. You are not allowed to have a Roku TV. You are not allowed to have toothbrushes in your bathroom because of boo-boo air. You are not allowed to have a white refrigerator. You are not allowed to eat at the Cheesecake Factory. If your friend is simply venting to you, it is still a red flag because she is a crisis friend. You are not allowed to wear Shein or Fashion Nova because it means that you are broke. You are not allowed to rewear the same outfit or the same shoes for more than two consecutive days. You are not allowed to wear box braids for longer than two weeks. Honorable mention, knotless braids cannot be worn for more than four days or people will make fun of your hair. You are not allowed to wear box braids to a birthday dinner. You are not allowed to dress nice or wear makeup to your friend's birthday dinner. You are not allowed to have fun past the age of 30. Honorable mention, once you turn 25. If you do not like carne asada, then you are a narcissist. If you do not like cereal, then you are a narcissist. Biting ice cream is a sign of a trauma response. You are not allowed to drink strawberry lemonade as a man or that is sassy. You are not allowed to have popcorn ceilings. You are not allowed to work a nine to five job. If your boyfriend doesn't let you use him as a step stool, then he hates you and it is a sign of avoided attachment style. Press on nails are ghetto. You are not allowed to date someone who is either two years younger than you or two years older than you, even though you guys are both adults. If you are a celebrity influencer or a clout chaser, but flying Southwest Airlines, you are broke. You are not allowed to breathe or you will be considered broke. Did I miss anything? You guys, this new vacuum from the TikTok shop is literally a lifesaver. The way it sucks up all the dirt within 10 minutes. I am never drinking regular water bottles again. I am going feral for this new water bottle that's on. Okay, so I gotta show you guys this mirror that I got off the TikTok shop. It is okay, so everyone's been asking me where I got these pants from. These Halara pants are- No more breaking chairs at Thanksgiving dinner. I got this chair from the TikTok shop and it's so- this is how you get a salon style blowout without going to the salon. So there's this five in one brush from the TikTok. You guys, I'm seeing so many people buy the fake unbrush. This is the real unbrush. Y'all really buying a $400 desk from Amazon where you can get it for 60 bucks on the TikTok? Y'all, the mirror is back in stock. It was out of stock before, but this selfie light has literally cured my sadness and made me look like Alex Earl. I feel like a queen again. Unbig your back now with the new walking pad treadmill. Only on. You guys, this shadow journal has made me fly. I'm so You guys, I got this Nigerian cheese grater off what the TikTok the shop. I'm sorry, but Wendy Williams is shaped like a pea. And why are you shaped like the letter I? Now, friend, 
Girl, you still delusional thinking your ex gonna come back? And you still think your daddy coming back from the grocery store that he went to in 1997? Okay, you did not have to go there. How do you not have your driver's license yet? And why is your wig still touching your eyebrows even when YouTube exists? Friend, aren't you too old to be breathing like that? I'm sorry, doesn't your birth year start with 19? What? Having two baby daddies before 30 is crazy. Like... Okay, so why do all of your siblings have different last names and why was your mother never married? Oh, uh, my mama don't count. Like, friend, aren't you tired of being single all the time? Like, you're gonna be old, lonely, and bitter. And, and aren't you tired of being cheated on by that bum that had three kids on you and literally has no teeth? Wow. So you gotta learn how to love yourself before you get into a relationship. And why do you have a baby with every single man that you date? This is your fifth kid in three years. Not too much, friend. A woman who's a quiet woman mm -hmm. is a deaf woman. Yep, I agree. Right. But a woman who's outspoken is a left woman. Mm -hmm. Wake it up. Mm -hmm. She said I never take accountability. What, what the heck is accountability? I don't That's know. a big word for Elmo. So I'm 25 with no kids. <laughs> 25 and childless? But what's wrong with a girl who has confidence, though? Why are you coming in here being so aggressive? How is that aggressive? That makes that, no sense. No, that's aggression. That's are aggression. You what? You coming in here being aggressive? For standing up for you myself? You're an opinionated female. How is that even opinion? Pick, shorty. I possess a physical proximity of intellectuality and spirituality from originality of a proximity of Jesus. Mm. Yes. Mm. Speak on A female it. that's 25, single and childless? Ew. Wow. Uh-oh. Oh, come La on. La Frederick, I don't know about that one. They gonna drag us on Twitter again, you know oh, Please, that. I'm not scared. I think you should put that effort into a gym. Oh, oh, hey, oh, 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 oh. too far, my brother. Now, nah, one thing you. about me, I'ma say it. No, let I, me no, bake. no, I get it. I get let me bake at 3 Yeah, I get it. Let me cook. Let me saute. You should allow more women on the podcast, though. <laughs> <laughs> Not wanting kids is selfish. Ooh. Now you know they gonna put us on Instagram Reels, La Frederick. Don't do that, mm, They not gonna like care. that. They can put me on Instagram Reels all they want. So you gonna wear a crop top and you wanna ask me for respect? You should already give respect nah, to the undesirable female. But I don't want yeah, you though. Yeah, I don't want you. You not even worth a dollar reader from Applebee's. Okay. Now they pushing an agenda on us, yes. fellas. Right. They trying to tear a black man yep. down. Yup, I said the yes, same thing. Yes, we gotta do something. And bro. I'm not standing for it. I gotta be vulnerable with y'all. What's up, bro? I haven't cheated on my girl in three hours. What? I really think I'm changing for real. That's no, what I'm yeah, talking about. Clap it yes, up. That's what I'm talking about. Three hours are so long. You better than me because I cheated right before we came here. All right, now, before we eat, let's bless the table. Let's bless the table. All right. <clears throat> Thank you, Father God, for this food that we are about to eat. Please let this food nourish our bodies, our minds, mm. our souls. Thank you, Lord, for the rocks, the animals, the grass, the sun, the moon, the go. stars. My antifungal cream, the Uber <sighs> Eats guy, the DoorDash guy. Oh Thank you, Lord, goodness. for the different cheeses that exist on Earth. The Brie, the Munster, the Pepper Jack, the Cheddar, the Gruyere. We the be here all night. <laughs> And thank you for my lovely podiatrist. He was able to cut all the bunions off my toes. Ew. And I am able to walk like a free woman. Lord, thank you, Jesus. And thank you, Lord, for blessing me with the ability to cook. Because my son girlfriend can't cook to save her life. <laughs> thank Ooh, you, Lord, for it. loving hip-hop, basketball wives. Oh, thank you, Lord, my... for inventing soap. As we will all be musty and Grandma, crusty like, and dusty and walking around smelling like bounce that butt. What? Grandma, and thank you, Lord, for toothpaste as I do not like them smells. Please allow my son to finally get a job, Father. I am tired. He is a bum. Mama, I'm right Please here. keep us away from all forms of evil, Father. Russia, ba 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 I rub you. All right, all right. Grandma, Grandma, oh, we, let me, let me, let me tell you something. Your, your, your hair, your hair, th these girls is not really your friend. They they act like they your friend, but they not your friend. Like I I I'm telling you, they 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 really.